This is Brady Miller from the OpenEMR project, and this video will cover choosing a user interface for OpenEMR 5.0. Uh, first, we will log into OpenEMR. This is currently what we call the tabs interface. This is actually a new user interface that was introduced with OpenEMR, OpenEMR 5.0, whereas you can see it's called tabs because it uses tabs. So if for example, I open up the administration global settings. It'll open up a new tab and show the tabs. As you can see, the menu is at the top. This is uh, different from our prior user interface, which is also available in 5.0, which is called the frames interface, shown here. As you can see, the menu is instead at the left-hand side. All the same menu items, essentially, are at the left-hand side. And if I open up, for example, Administration Globals, it then opens up a new screen inside of the frames, which is why we call them frames, because we consider these this to be the top frame and this to the bottom frame. And you can even turn these, hide them, and show them via this control. So OpenR 5.0 can actually support either using the tabs or the frames layout. In order to set this, you go to Administration Globals, and you go into Layout, and you'll see Tabs. If you change this to Frames, note that you do need to log out and log in to after changing the settings. So we're going to save it first, and then we're going to log out and log back in. As you can see, now we're in the Frame Settings. Um, so when we set it in Administration Globals, that set it for the entire, all the users. There are some times where some users prefer one or the other, so users can actually set it themselves if they go into miscellaneous and preferences. And there they can actually set their own, let's say they want to have tabs instead of frames. They can set tabs here, save. And again, they need to log out. Log back in, and now that user, Billy Smith, will be using tabs. As you can see, the tabs does have a little bit different of uh, a feel to it. Again, all the menu items at the top. Billy, if you, if you actually click on settings and just go directly to the user settings for this user. If you uh, want to see a patient, you click on this uh, search icon, which then shows up a screen, and you can click on it, and it'll show the patients. Again, opening a new tab for the patients and then a new tab for the encounters. Another way to search for patients that's more advanced would be to use uh, this type of search, where you can click in any, you know, enter any of these entries and then click search. And then again, it'll find the user that applies. So that's the difference between uh, the uh, old, the uh, frames layout and the new tabs layout. There are also a couple other things that could be done um, in terms of user interface with themes. If I were to go back to the uh, frames layout first, um, and again you go to administration globals, and here's again where we change the layout. There's also two themes here, one called a tabs layout theme and one called a general theme. We'll focus first on the general theme. So right now we're choosing the default theme, which is light, but there are other themes you could choose. Um, there's also tan, which is also a newer theme, as light is. So you can click that, and as you can see, the layout changes, or the theme changes, sorry, just the theme. The older, uh, more we call them legacy themes, are also available, uh, such as OEMR. So again, if you click on that, you click Save. It'll go to the this theme. And again, we can go back to the light theme, which is the default and what most people do prefer now. That's a newer theme. So it's a little different. If we go back to the tabs now, again, go to Administration Globals. And again, you'll see the same, the same themes. Again, the general theme will cover basically everything here in this part of the screen in the tabs. And then you have this other entry called Tabs Layout Theme. And this is really just covering the theme that's actually here at the top. And I'll show you what I mean. 
So if I, right now we have two of them, you can either do full or compact. Right now we're looking at full. If we do compact, then I will click, then you click save again. And with tabs, you have to log out and log in to see it. And again, you'll see how it's different now. You still have the menu here. You have all, everything's there. It's just different looking and it's, it's actually a little bit more, we call it compact because it's a lot more compact in terms of the menu items and uh, things like that. And again, we can go back to globals. And we can now also change the general theme, which again, changes everything in the tabs, but not, so it's really changing this area right here. So we'll go, we'll change that also to tan, as we did before. And that, you, this you don't really need to log out because you can see it, but it will look nicer if you do, again, log out and log back in. As you can see, everything, now if it's, you have this new theme, the tan. Um, so that covers the, uh, the basics on the, really the two different user interfaces. Uh, which are either the tabs user interface or the frames user interface, along with themes.